Good afternoon. Um, so we had a special request today come from someone who uh, wanted to see what it looked like um, since the very beginning now. So since day one, we're going to give you a walk up of what the goats have achieved. Um, you know, they've only been over in this area for a few weeks now. I think maybe three. Um, our valley where the drainage runs looks really good. Uh, they're working on getting rid of the rest of that briary stuff. On this side, as you can see, it's pretty cleaned up. That's what's growing in from the spring since they've been moved. So that's about three weeks worth of growth. As you can see, even in the nooks and crannies in between the trees, they've gotten just about everything that's green. What they've gotten too easy. Now they're working on stuff like trees like this one right here, this little one right there. They all push that over and devour it and eventually eat it all the way up. You can see the house that, you know, once you come around the barn, about 500 feet. Couldn't even see that five feet away, pretty much. Definitely a believer in that, what goats can achieve in a very, very short period of time. Now granted, with the babies, we now have back up to 19, and we got rid of quite a few this year. So, if you're counting, we were probably close to 30. Maybe a little under. But, our little pasture areas growing in. They compress these branches down, breaks off all the small stuff, and just keep crumpling it down until it's little teeny stuff falling down by the creek and it gets washed away. Pretty neat. So. There's the house. This was a trail. Literally, just a little teeny trail at one time. This was all overgrown. And that's it. And there's the update compared to day one. You guys have a great day.